Dear friends, welcome to Actions of Technology. Here I am going to explain how to create a tricky pattern in our CAD software. First, we need to create a small rectangle. About the, I am going to create the fan pattern. Languages don't need to worry about languages. This our software is multi language software. You can change any language whichever you like. We we are just creating the rectangle patterns and just give the proper measurement. This. This spec sheet we already insert in our CAD software. Be careful within a sec you can input all the measurements in our CAD software. Once you ins input all measurements, all those you just add the that measure in our pattern. That's it. Let let look how to make a fan pattern in our CAD software. Now I am going to create the tie point of the pattern, and now I am going to give. Full length of our pattern. Yes. Now I'm giving fan open divided by two for minus one because that is uh, we are giving seam allowance, right? This is knee point. Here all this is for just uh, calculator for it. You can add, remove, plus or minus for your spec sheet. Just create the rectangle. Just here I am not touching any of the tools. Now I am giving curve shape. You can say give the curve whatever you like. We we can change the curve shape for different different angles. This is very user friendly. You can move it that curve any way. Yes, like this. Then we are going to give the pair of the pattern. Now I am giving the back part for a rise. Sorry, front rise, front rise. Now I am giving the proper measurements in for. Uh, top or uh, open of the top, and I'm giving the curve shapes of back and hip points. Front part. Now we are going to create back parts. This is for uh, the pleats. This we need to do pleats for. Uh, fan necessary most of the pattern necessarily we need to give for woven fabric we need to give this curve proper curve shape whatever you like this is very simple way to create the curve shapes and now we are going to give proper shapes just trace it out this patterns now because we shall almost complete our pattern now we need to trace it out this pattern including the then you can select the pattern name And you can just click OK, symmetric or something. Just click OK. You can use the language of our software. That is, that's not a big issue. You can. This is our software is multi-language, so you can change it. This, uh, this pattern, sir, this highly linked connect. So you can move the pattern, and change the measurements, whatever you like. This is our curve changing point. You can change the measurements with the uh, proper shape. We have full control. Now I just give the grading now. See, it's very fast. See, because we already give this message in our spec sheet with all the sizes grading. So we don't need to create the all sizes pattern again and again. Once you create the base pattern, that our CAD software automatically give the proper grading in our in your other other styles. Now we are going to create the back part of the pattern. This is back part now.
because we are having spec sheet proper measurements and everything i am not going to click any of this tool any of the tool in our cat software this is very very simple like you you can create the manual pattern right that in the same way i am going to create this pattern just nothing an issue just create the pattern in your own way you can create the lines whichever you like wherever you like you can give proper shapes proper measurement everything within a second now uh, now we are going we are creating the back pattern yes this is also almost done after once we done all our patterns give the proper shapes and we need to trace it this is for uh, this is our pleat back pleat then just give proper measurements then just select select then we need we need to trace it out the pattern we give proper shapes and the top yes that's it now we are going to trace it out this pattern select 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 once we done our selection then now we are uh, select our split now we are giving proper name i just trace it out this pattern now pattern is almost done and our grading is almost done i we are i am giving the seam allowances now you can change the seam allowances it's very easily you can give proper seam allowances curves everything and giving the dot notch notch point of the pattern work for the fold notch fold notch giving it grading is already done because we already giving the spec sheet measurements right so you don't need to create grading 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 see you can add the size for this is yes m l is always there you can add the size whichever you like you can change the measurements uh, how much you want just click see this total measurements everything will automatically change now we are going to marker making section just select everything is coming down it's very easy and now we are going to calculate the gsm piece weight everything we done this gsm and piece weight now we are going to save in a proper way this is this is giving because you can change the language whatever you like because with, with this is just for demo purpose i'm showing this language for hong kong language you can change this language after after you after you can whatever you like just select now here if you want to change or cut the pattern for your uh, purposes you can easily cut this pattern for different different ways now i am going to cut this pattern for marker making purpose if you want to cut for small small icon just you can cut it just click click cut click cut that's it one part is automatically cut and now on another part is automatically cut and now yes that's it see on the cut because the different kinds of styles you can cut it our pattern after after you make grading everything is done after also you can cut our pattern and go to marker and create proper shape Thank you for watching our pant making demo. For more details, kindly visit www.actionsoft.org. Thank you very much.